Yes, welcome back. Today I am working a, a wheel loader L220H Volvo wheel loader and uh, this is uh, coming the errors applied parking brake. Okay, so up is uh, I am going to open its parking brake but its parking brake is not uh, opening. Okay, so I remove the you can see I try to remove its parking brake you can see it's not removing I push other side but its parking brake still is there first of all I will check the parking brake solenoid is working or not so viewers this one is a this one is a my parking brake solenoid okay and this one is a direction warp downsides so I check the voltages are coming here okay after while I check the resistance of this solenoid okay and uh, because problem is this this time I will uh, going to change this complete but after I will let you know the problem is this one or uh, this uh, uh, direction valve so which one has the problem so actually I just want to show you this is the our brick solenoid with the directional valve so i will remove it completely and fix another one there is a four bolt one two three four i move the four bolts okay and then the solenoid will come out and i fix other solenoid then check okay i check already check the voltages voltages are coming here okay and uh, but the brake is not releasing so viewers you can see I have moved the this is parking brake solenoid okay with the direction of all but this time in front of you this one is the uh, solenoid park brake solenoid so I'm going to check its resistance so uh, here in this area attach the directional valve okay so now I will check its the resistance its resistance should be 20 to 30 ohm so this is my multimeter I put the multimeter at the 200 ohms okay so now i'm going to check its resistance so you can see if the resistance is uh, showing the 23 ohm so my multimeter is at the 200 ohm so it's showing the 23 it's mean my resistance is okay it's means solenoid is okay now i will uh, check the resistance i also will check the resistance of the new uh, solenoid which i have uh, ordered and that has come with the direction of work I also check the resistance of that solenoid and I will confirm my solenoid is okay. So if solenoid is okay then it's mean the problem in the directional valve. So uh, my new order has come now I will show you. So you can see this one is my new solenoid with the directional valve. So I will check this one is a solenoid. Okay. This both this side is a solenoid and uh, you can see this downside this one is a directional valve okay this is the mechanical part hydraulic part and above is a our electrical part now i check the resistance put a multimeter at the 200 ohms and uh, i will check the resistance of this uh, uh, new solenoids so uh, we will see what is the resistance of this new one uh, this new one is a 20 ohm so it's mean uh, my old solenoid is also good one but i will install because this i order new one now so i will put completely uh, this uh, new one with solenoid and direction valve but problem is in the direction valve not in, not in the solenoid so we just know i am going to fix this uh, solenoid then after we check the parking brake is uh, released or not huh? so we just know i am fixing my new uh, solenoid with its uh, directional valve uh, my direction valve have the problem but not the uh, solenoid but i am fixing new solenoid with it okay so this is a four bolt i am fixing it So viewers, I have fixed my solenoid. Now I'm fixing this uh, uh, connector, and after I will go inside the cabin and check my problem has solved or 
So viewers, now I am inside the cabin. Operator is with me. We are going to uh, push the. Now you can see the park breaker is there. So he will uh, uh, this uh, move the push the button. Release the park brake. Okay, so you can see light has gone. This means park brake is released. So my problem is solved. So he now is push the uh, move the loader back side. He put the gear back side. So loader is moving. It's mean my park brake is released. So my problem is solved. So now again he applied the park brake and released it. So you can see the park brake when applied park brake light coming when he release park brake is a light has gone so my problem is solved hope you like this video please don't forget to subscribe my channel and share this video to your friends my park brake has released and the shovel is moving forward and 